welcome in this video tutorial we are going to learn about a conditional statement in php so conditional statement are used for uh, perform an action that is depend on the condition uh, if we are talking in a normal language the conditional statement is like uh, Latin English language if John give me money then I will buy new shoes so here uh, I will buy a shoes this action is depend on the condition and condition is that if John give me money are the same logic is applied in a programming language in PHP or uh, let if variable a equal to 10 then result is great if variable is less than 10 then result is poor so this is the theoretical part of a conditional statement and now let's move on the program so let we have a uh, okay guys uh, I am going to do this program in an object oriented way so you can learn uh, object oriented way with the conditional statement so like I have a class dash and a function condition and I'm going to make a T this is the object of our test class and guys this is the basic structure for oops now let's start the uh, conditional statement work let we have a variable x equal to 10 okay and now if we will if here uh, we are going to check if x equal equal to double equal to means we are comparing them and single equal to means uh, we are putting the right side value to the left side variable okay equal equal to 10 then echo result is good fine guys uh, now make a call our uh, condition function with the help of t And let's check the output now. The result is good. The reason of this because the x is equal to 10. If I'm going to write here x is 11, then c. The result is nothing. So, uh, this is the basic conditional statement okay in conditional statement we have a condition this is the condition part and this is the result part so we can write like something like this if condition and result This is a basic syntax of a conditional statement. So now we are going to learn how many conditional statements present in PHP. So we have mainly three types of conditional statement. One is if condition. Second is 
if else condition if else if else if and else condition so three types of conditions are okay so we uh, made a, a, the basic statement this is belong to this part if condition now i want to make the else if condition so this this is with uh, we have done now and now we are going to do this if else condition so for this uh, if is present now and we can make this else with this echo result is unknown fine guys so here the result is 10 uh, condition is equal to 10 so the result is good means this part will be execute and if I am write something else like I have I write 9 the result is unknown I write 100 still result is unknown because x is not equal to the this value x is only equal to the 10 so if just we write 10 the result is good in only one condition okay in if else condition uh, we have a one known condition and other is unknown condition like uh, here first condition we know here that if x is equal equal to this this value then this will uh, result this will uh, print the first value if condition if x is equal to something other uh, means if x is written true then only if else condition is executed so in if else condition we have two part one is known and another is unknown and at, at last we have one more else else if and else condition in in this uh, conditional statement we have many condition we can use two three four five six as much as we want so this the uh, let take example of this first i have to delete this and make here else if and write if x equal equal to five then write A result is not good this is the if belong to first part and else if belong to second part and this else is belong to third so we have a many condition here and the last else part is for unknown uh, unknown result and that they both are for known result I'm going to write here the result is unknown and let's check it out uh, we have x equal to 10 so this condition will go to true and result will be good yes if i am right here result equal to 5 
and this, this value is also 5. Then the result is also good. If I'm right here 10. Uh, I'm right here just put 5 so now x is equal to 5 so if else if condition will go to true and uh, the second condition will be made true and this will be print here the result is not good and if I'm right something else here like I write 30 then result will be unknown because result is not even 10 not even 5 result is unknown so in this way if else condition also work so these are the basic type of uh, conditional statement in PHP and other language also the same condition okay guys thanks for watching and if you learn something please subscribe us and if you have something confusing or issue with our videos please comment us or contact me with email i will try to help you i help you out and thanks guys thanks for watching